they can be short-sighted in certain aspects. And one example of that is uh, prescribed burning. Uh, they try to make it a science that since uh, there were wildfires and human beings have built roads that may have decreased wildfires and put out wildfires, well then the human beings should burn to take the place of wildfires, but they burn far more frequently than wildfires ever burn because that helps to build the agency, its personnel, uh, its power over nature, its uh, power of uh, making decisions of all kinds, including uh, timber uh, production. The Unfortunate fact is that the timber industry first supported the research in the universities and elsewhere that found that the prescribed burning was uh, beneficial in getting rid of hardwoods and increasing the density of and growth of pines, for example, in the south, and, uh, of commercial trees, which are often conifers. And uh, the, the forestry schools grabbed onto that and tried to make uh, fire a scientific remedy for everything. It just so happens that it helps the profits of not only government agencies but also private timber companies that want to raise as many trees as fast as possible to sell and they don't care what happens to the general ecosystem in the meanwhile. And that can be harmful in the long range even to the uh, economy, the making of money because sooner or later, well, they sap the soil enough to where they have to use fertilizers and uh, that does not adequately restore the soil or hold the water or anything like that. And so the long-range effects can be disastrous for the economy as well. Uh, 